Karibu sana pastor. Thank you. Praise the Lord. We want to thank the Lord for bringing us here today. Happy to see all of you. I would say my feelings are mixed. When I'm sitting here, I'm looking, I'm listening to the singing and uh, this is as best as it gets. Let me tell you, uh, this singing is as best as it gets. Let me say, this singing is as best as it gets. When you move from here, you go to other places, uh, you don't get this kind of singing. This is special. So today I'm listening to excellent music. I was just sitting there and saying, mm, let me listen, let me capture the moment. Now, uh, today will be my last day officially as your pastor. And uh, been preaching for some time now. Uh, Joshua Magero, the first sermon I preached was in April 1985. So I've preached for almost uh, over 39 years now, and since I started, I've not stopped. That's what God called me to do. That is what I enjoy doing best more than anything else in the world. There are many things we do, church administration we have done, but sharing the word of God is when I feel fully. So, Pastor Kigundu, we, we thank God for you. Um, uh, thank you for having been a pillar to um, the foundation of this church and for the Amogilead. We want to wish you the very best for having the molded us to be men and, and um, the pillars of this church. And as you venture into a new world, we pray for God's blessing. And we pray that God's mercy will follow you all the days of your life. We thank you for the incremental work you've done in our lives and we thank God for you. I'll miss you guys. Seriously, I'll miss you. But let me ask you, Magero, how can I miss you, Kabisa, when I'm going to my wife? Tell me. Uh, Pastor Kigundu, the legacy you are leaving here, it is quite evident that you are called to call sinners out of the world. And we are leaving a group of people whom you have inspired to be true Christians rather than just people who come to church and obey the doctrine. Thanks so much, Pastor, for the work that you have done and the work that was still ahead of you, may you go forth and do it in the full ability that God has given unto you. We are living a church that understands that true religion is on the act, but not just uh, the tradition of the church. May God be with you, may God be with your family, and may God be with you in the next journey that you are going to undertake. Thank you so much for myself, for my family, from Gilead family, may God continue living your heart. Let's so offer this closing prayer, the last prayer of consecration to God. I'm making the service. No marvelous grace of our loving God. If you hear the voice of the Lord has spoken to you, please come to the front as we celebrate with you. It's been uh, over 12 years of learning from Pastor and I'm learning and relearning things for Pastor Kigundi. Thank you so much for being to us an oasis. Thank you for being such a pillar. Yeah. You've walked with us uh, through every endeavor. Remember to call La Patana at four in the morning. Thank you so much. As we go uh, away from here, may the light of the Lord be with you. May the grace that you have preached to us today, that you keep on preaching to us, may the grace be with you to cover you until we meet again here on earth or better still, at the pearly gates of heaven. Thank you so much, Pastor. Yes, just as my husband has said, we are so much grateful. Our heart is full because of the time we've had with you. And uh, as a family, you've been a pillar to us, a father and a priest too, because you've taken us through the time we were coaching uh -huh. for, yeah. for the ten, ten years. years. <laughs> and <laughs> we never gave up because of you. Yes, yes, and our yes, wedding... Yes was the way it was because of you and we pray that God and our will... baby was dedicated yeah, by he did. Pastor he dedicated our so baby. thank you so much and uh, if you have another one you'll you have, to come, back you'll have to come back <laughs> and dedicate the yeah, same baby sure. so thank you so much Pastor we love you and we'll never forget you yeah and Pastor uh, 
take you all the weddings to make up for more than a pastor. By the way, almost Over, all the weddings. Yes. I'm uh, the matron, he's the MC, and the pastor is the visiting minister. We will miss you. We will, we will and go well. We shall keep in touch. Thank you so much, Patty, and bye bye. Strong and very courageous. Be careful to obey all the law my servant Moses gave you. Do not turn from it to the right or to the left, that you may be successful wherever you go. Verse 8 he says, Keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. Then he ended up, he says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go towards. Or two phrases. Read and meditate upon the word all the days of your life. Secondly, keep close to God all the days of your life. And that to me is the secret of prosperity. I know there are some will meet, others will not. But God be with you till we meet again at the feet of our Lord. Amen and amen. Let's stand up. We pray for you. Father, we have been with your children for many years, some from Kuzda, and as a church here, almost four years. We are here because, O oh Lord, you have brought us here. We are here because of your amazing, amazing, amazing grace. Amazing mother's grace. It is grace that has brought us together as Gilead saved this far. We trust the same grace will take us home. Therefore, Lord, I commend these, your children, your servants in your hands. May your grace be sufficient for them every day of our lives until we meet at your feet. In Jesus' name we pray. And all of us say... Amen and amen to God be the glory. God be with you till we meet again. God bless you.